Hello guys and welcome back to my channel, LSPDO Farm 5M Gaming. Uh, first off, I want to say good evening to everyone. Hope y'all had a fantastic day. Hope y'all have a fantastic evening. So, I know it's been a while, but not too long ago I stated I had received the hot box, the hot sauce challenge box for Christmas. I also said that I was going to do this on video, but I had, but I'm just now getting around to doing it. So, the different levels of this hot sauce challenge is first going to be the jalapeno hot sauce. Shouldn't be that bad. If it'll focus here. Shouldn't be that bad. I mean, I eat jalapenos all the time, so. I mean, doesn't smell bad, really, so. I mean, I know I'm going to regret it for sure, considering the fact the hottest pepper there is on this challenge is going to be... That's right. Ghost pepper, guys. This is going to be the hottest one yet in this box here. And the the ghost pepper is going to be over a million on the scoville on the heat scale. So, I actually currently have the box with me here. Um question is where okay so it goes up to 1 million tops on the heat scale here so I mean I got two chocolate milks on standby here and a half gallon of regular milk in the bag so on the chips I mean they don't really smell like jalapeno lime but not gonna do too much concerning the fact that oh I say I'm not gonna do too much and then it just pours a whole lot out so I mean, just as I figured, I mean, it's going to taste like the real deal, like the actual jalapeno itself, just in a liquid form. I mean, this one, you know, not a super watery. I mean, not a great deal of uh, thickness. This one, I do like it. It's not that hot, you know doesn't really stay hot for that long really not even spicy to be honest with you I mean come on I'm sure we've all had a jalapeno and once at least once or twice in our lives so all right let's check out level two here so level two is gonna be the chipotle uh chipotle is actually one of my favorite sauces out there to be honest with you so uh, actually one in particular is gonna be uh the southern chipotle sauce that's always good Chipotle sauce. Of course, it doesn't say how hot, how, you know, what it is on the heat units, so. Looks like the Chipotle sauce was actually. Came out in. Oh, never mind. I don't know whenever this first came out, but let's see if it's any good. Let's see how good it is here. Mm. Uh. Give it a good shake here. Okay, it has a different cap to it. That's good. The other one, it just poured out like crazy. I mean, nothing 
I mean, nothing to really slow the flow of it. Got a jalapeno lime. You don't want to use, see, the thing is, I don't want to use too much, mainly because I, I'm not really supposed to have all, too much spicy stuff, so I don't want to do too much of the sauce, and, you know, it doesn't take very much either, especially if you cook with it, you know, it just takes a little bit, because, I mean, you don't want to overpower your, your food, and then again, you don't want to under-season it, or add too, you don't want to add too little or too much, if you add too much, then it's just going to overpower everything else, and if you add too little, then you're really not going to have then you really can't taste it, so you want it to be just right. Mm. Bit my tongue. Okay. Okay. The uh, chipotle sauce, uh, again, very good one. I would, I definitely recommend trying it if you do like spicy stuff. If you don't like spicy stuff, don't try these. I mean, <laughs> you're not gonna like them. But if you like spicy stuff, then I definitely recommend trying the chipotle hot sauce. Um, I, I like it. You know, and next time I order myself a subway sandwich, I'm definitely using this chipotle. So. So I can have a little bit of little bit of a spice to it. Okay, so let's see what level three is here. So level three is going to be the cayenne pepper. Oh, another one, another good one. I mean cayenne. I really like it. Oh, and these are glass too. I gotta be careful. <laughs> cayenne. Of course, zero calories, it states. It says to do, like, on the serving size, only do one teaspoon. That's pretty much what I've been doing. Um, or sometimes it's just a little less, just so I don't, as I said, just so I don't go overboard. Give it a good shake here. There we go. I know the last time, and normally, th and to be honest with y'all, this is the first time I've ever done a face cam video. Um, now, normally this will, unless I do any other vlogs or anything, this might be the first and only face vlog I do. Um, or video in, that, in general. Mainly because, you know, I'm not a very big fan of doing the, you know, face time stuff, the face vid stuff, but, you know... For the hot sauce challenge, it only makes sense, guys. So I'm I'm not gonna record. I'm just, I'm not just gonna record a uh, turn my voice recorder on and then you know figure something out on you know and do it just while playing a game because you know then y'all basically can't see my reaction, you know. So you know and try to open. I mean, it smells pretty good. I mean, kind of smells a little sweet. Um, not too hot. Again, guys, not too much at all. N you never want to put too much. It's about perfect right there. And every time I pour a little bit, it always drips out of my pants. <laughs> I got to do laundry tomorrow anyways. So, kind of go ahead and sandwich that on top there. Again, not that bad. Pretty good. Um, as I guess, a little bit of sweetness to it. The sweetness hits first, then the spicy. And with the jalapeno lime chips, you know, the citrus from the lime, you know, it just helps. Um, 
on round, it's pretty amazing. I mean, so far, I have I'm not having any. I'm not having any problems with any of these sauces here. Uh, what is level four here? Halfway through. Garlic. Gotta tell you, personally, I'm not a big fan of garlic, but uh, now any but anytime it's in a salsa or in a sauce alone, I'll eat it. But I I don't know what it is, but I do not like garlic powder in particular. That one it's just I don't know what it is about me. I just can't, I can't eat it. I mean, sriracha hot sauce, you know, I already know what this one tastes like. I mean, I go to Panda Buffet all the time. If you, if y'all don't know what that restaurant is, or if y'all don't have one where you're from, then, uh, that's mainly because, I mean, then it's a restaurant down here in Oklahoma where I, where I'm at, uh, but y'all can, Pretty much get on the internet, you know, see what it, see where it's at, uh, if, if there's one in y'all's general location. So, let's go ahead and take that label off, that, not label, the wrapper. Give it a good shake. Perfect. Another chip here and there. Okay, garlic one. I mean, smells okay. I mean, smells like garlic, really. I mean, now really, how hot can garlic hot sauce really be? I mean, because garlic. I mean, come on. I use it all the time when I. I use it all the time. I mean, garlic butter whenever I make that. Also, I mean, go online, look up the recipe for garlic butter. If y'all got the ingredients, definitely make it. It is amazing stuff. I love it. You can do, uh, uh, you can make a steak or something, do like a, and do some garlic butter, melt it over it. Uh, it is amazing, uh, especially if you're using grill. I love it personally. I recommend trying it. And big shout out to Gordon Ramsay, even though I know you're most likely not going to see this video. But big shout out to you anyways. Uh, I actually got... Says, recording. Hold on, what was he going to say? Do you want to take a bath? No. Anyways. As I was saying, um... Big fan of the, um... Garlic butter, big shout out to Gordon Ramsay. Uh, you're actually the one who, I actually watched your video and learned how to make it just by your, your, instructional, your instructional video. So, you know, big shout out to you. You're one of the main people who inspired me to start cooking as well as, you know, my cooking instructor whenever I took, when I was in college. Um, so let's see. Again, not too much, cause you know, it is going to spread out over the chip, and you know, as as it spreads, you know, it's already getting on the chip itself, I mean, so, and normally by the time you spread it all around, you've already got one teaspoon of it, so, again, let's see. Okay. Okay. be honest with you, they can't even call this hot sauce, really. It is not even hot. I mean, well, correction, they can call it hot sauce, but they don't know what they're talking about. I mean, okay. Let's have a five here. Sriracha. I mean, I would skip it, but, you know, then, because I've tried every single one of these peppers at one point in time. 
Um, no joke. I've tried every single one of these at one point. So, except for the ghost pepper. Wait, never mind. Scratch I have tried ghost pepper. Uh, went to Buffalo Wild, Wild Wings a few years back, and uh, I had actually regretted that one. Uh, at the time, I was I regretted it at the same time, and then I said, "Oh, never again." But we're here, and you know, but as far as I've gotten level five, I can't back out now, and I ain't going, and I'm not going to, guys. Okay, the mango sauce here, you know, kind of smell, kind of a little bit of su sweetness based off the smell. Um, now, whenever I put do, put the hot sauce on, I try to get it like right in the, you know, curve, like right in the middle, so you know, just so it doesn't. You know, go too bad. Whew. Perfect. I mean, not too bad, really. Tricky there. Yeah, it is mango. Tastes nothing like mango. And drink here. Okay, now what some people will do is they'll end up taking, they'll end up doing this challenge. Okay, you gotta do every single one of them, wait five minutes. Personally, I think that's just flat out torture. Self torture. I'm not gonna do that. Main reason, I don't feel like getting sick like everyone else does whenever they do this. Alright. But. Again, yes, it's hot. Um, at the same time, it's really not that bad. I like it personally. Um, but at the same time, like I said, if you can't handle your spice, don't do it. I mean, next, which one did I do just now? Mango. Sriracha. What's I've done, Mango and Sriracha? No need to do those. So, I think I'm going to go ahead and skip level 7 guys, and I'm going to go ahead and get level 8 done, being the uh, ghost pepper, so, <sighs> um, I've tried ghost pepper hot sauce before, but that was whenever I had to sign a waiver, 
Um, oh, excuse me, guys. Sorry about that. So that's whenever I had to sign a waiver. Um, personally, I'm not ready for this. But at the same time, like I said, I, I'm not going to back out now, guys. I mean, I just... I mean... So like I said, I'm going to go to the doctor and then put it off for a whole year. <laughs> I mean... Which I used to do that whenever I was younger. Uh... Alright. Okay. Wow. Uh, just the smell alone. I'm gonna go ahead and get this second one open. And, uh... I'm disappear here for a sec. I'm gonna go ahead and get that half gallon, because... Just by the smell alone... This hot sauce is going to be painful here. All right. Keep this back on standby. There's a lot of stuff falling over on my desk. Egg, the hot sauce is running away before I can even get to the ghost paper. Well, that's fine, because the ones that are trying to run away, I've already tested. So, guys, I made it to the last and final round. Main question is, can I survive it? And as the box says, Hot sauce challenge. How hot is hot? But you know, you know what? I added on to that. How hot is hot? Can you complete the challenge? We'll see. But at this time, it's can I complete the challenge? Well, I think so far the answer has been yes. And I know a lot of people say, oh, well, these challenges are outdated. But at the same time, guys, personally, I didn't just want to do it just, you know, along without recording it. Because to me, that's just no fun, you know. I wanted to have a little fun with it, guys, you know. But here goes nothing. Lord, help me on this. And I am not going to do a tablespoon, cu teaspoon, because it does not take a teaspoon of this. I'm going to fill the spice. Ooh. I did not want to swallow that, guys. I'm going to be honest with you guys. My mouth is on fire right now.
All right, guys, so there's the answer. I survived. Yes, my mouth is on fire. Um, yeah, I completed the challenge. Do I regret it? Huh, not at this very second. Am I going to regret it later? Most likely. Am I going to do it again? Oh, yeah. Anyways, guys, so far, I hope y'all are enjoying all the videos I've put out so far. Um, big shout out to you, Criminal Justice, as well. I want to give it big thanks to you. Uh, just what you provide and how much you've done. Um, your videos, you know, like I said, they inspire me to make these. Um, big shout out to all the, big shout out to all the members of CJRP, uh, otherwise known as Criminal Justice Roleplay for 5M. Again, anyone else that sees this video, if you would like to join Criminal Justice Roleplay for 5M, you know, you can click on the Discord link below. I'll provide a Discord link for the, um, Roleplay server. That one is going to be under the tab, want to join us. I'll post a link for Criminal Justice, uh, LSPFR support server. Uh, I'll post a link down to my Discord as well as my, uh, oh, excuse me. And I believe that's it. Yeah. So if you enjoyed this video, please leave a thumbs up. If not, you know, that's always, that's fine too. Uh, if you're new to my channel, please hit that subscribe button. Make sure you turn on that, click on that bell for, to stay notified whenever I upload the next time. That being said, guys, hope y'all enjoyed this again. Take care, stay healthy, and God bless.